Hey everyone, I am Ken Ross here. I'm a business consultant that specializes in reducing costs for companies. And here today I have a very special guest. Her name is Felice Nichols and she does melanin wrapping paper. How are you today? I'm good, Ken. How are you? I'm good. And uh, awesome time to be here uh, in business and awesome businesses. What, what I like to highlight on my channel is one of the things that I really spend a lot of time doing is, is finding exceptional entrepreneurs in business and wanting to discuss what their business is about and yours is no exception but before we get into that why don't you tell me a little bit about your background all right so like you said my name is felice nichols and so my background is actually in graphic design um i am a self-taught graphic design artist i've been doing graphic design since i was in middle school back in my space and black planet days um, I'm not new to being a business owner. I have sold hair extensions. I've done network marketing. So I've done business for a long uh, time in my lifetime, even though I'm only 32 years old. But my current business venture is Melanin Wrapping Paper. And um, I'm really excited about this business because I feel like I finally found a way to turn my natural skill set into a tangible product. So what yes, I do absolutely. is I create wrapping paper, and gift novelty items for people of color. Awesome. And yes, definitely uh, something that you can leverage your skills in graphic artists, uh, graphic arts, something I, I can see actually very much portrayed in the product that you offer. And you, you kind of mentioned to me uh, when we first talked that you kind of started this by accident. Can you kind of give us the backstory on how, how this all started? Yeah, so this business, it wasn't intentional at all. So part of my my um, personal growth journey is meditation. I meditate every day, even if it's just 10 minutes, 5 minutes, 15 minutes. You know, I just try to give myself a moment of solitude before I get my day started. And so there was a time that I was meditating, doing my normal routine, and something said, make melanin wrapping paper. And so when I heard that, I was like, okay, I'm going to do this. So I, I created a wrapping paper that was um, for Christmas. I created a Black Santa Christmas theme wrapping paper. And when I put that product out there, I got so much support from people. And it was at that moment that I realized, you know what? When something said make melanin wrapping paper, it didn't mean just do a one-time project. Like this really has the potential to be an entire brand. So after I got the support for that one product, I took some steps back in and said, you know, let's let's stop focusing on just doing this one Christmas thing. Let's make this turn into a business. Absolutely, absolutely. And I can see that uh, kind of portrayed in your variety of different products right now. I, I did happen to go to your website and you offer a nice variety of different things. I really love the superhero card. I think it's something that's really great. I may have to purchase one right after this yeah. for my daughter because I really think that um, it's important to, to highlight that we can be superheroes, right? And so yeah. kind of tell me what your plans are, your goals are for, uh, for the shop. Are you planning on doing an expanded line? Are you trying to do some some partnerships, licensing, anything like that? I mean, just, just help us understand kind of your goals. Yeah, so um, my goal is definitely to have wrapping paper for every occasion, you know, just like how you, you saw the superheroes, that yeah. is great for any occasion. Anybody, you know, that's a superhero in your eyes. I would love to do um, anniversaries, you know, things like that. And I've also just opened my gift shop. So not only will I be creating wrapping papers, but I'm also going to be creating physical products. Uh, my first product that I just created is actually a yoga mat. And it features a, a black girl doing yoga on that. So I will be creating actual items that people can buy, like water bottles, beach towels, um, decor for your home that is centered around um, the Afrocentric lifestyle. Yes, and definitely can see that that same touch there that you want to bring some of your own personality and some of the products mm -hmm. that you offer. So that is a really, really great thing that you get to do. You get to really express yourself in the products that you offer. That's great. Um, tell me one of your favorite stories about this business so far. What, what would be something that you could highlight for us? My favorite thing, honestly, about the business is really just seeing my son watch what I'm doing. Um, I have a four-year-old son, and so he's watched my growth when I was doing other businesses. He's seen what I was doing, and I honestly just love watching him watching me you know he knows oh is that wrapping paper mommy oh look at the superheroes oh they look like me and so it, it really just makes me proud 
as a parent, as a mother, as an entrepreneur to do something that I'm proud of and that my son is proud of. You know, I, I know that um, it makes him happy to see me doing these things. And I hope that this will encourage him when he gets older to want to start his own business. Absolutely. And I, I, I really appreciate that answer because that's exactly why I started a business. That's why I really wanted to show my daughter something that I never really got the privilege of seeing is, and mm -hmm. that's being passionate about something so much that you're willing to, to bet on yourself. Right. And that's mm -hmm. what I see you're, you're doing for your son is that he can see that like, Hey, yeah. I see me in these products. I see your passion for what it is you're doing. And as he grows up, he's going to want or can explore at least that as an option. Yeah. And that's, I mean, that's just amazing. That's awesome. Yeah. So, um, want to talk about one thing I saw uh, on your website. Really love this quote. It says, she wants to show the world that nothing is impossible and that true happiness and fulfillment does exist. Can you expand on that idea? What 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 do you mean by that? Yeah. So, you know, it's, it's honestly kind of crazy that my name is Felice because it does mean happy. And my mom, she, before I was born, she felt like I was a happy baby in the womb. And as an adult, I feel like my main focus is finding what true happiness is in life. And as I've grown, I've learned that happiness is created on the inside. And so a lot of people think that tangible things, you know, the items, the cars that we drive, where we live, where we go, what we do on the weekends is what makes us happy. And I really want to show people like there's so much more to what makes us happy. And if we can find that true fulfillment, that true peace inside, then that is what reflects in your outer world. That is what gives us those things. You know, we have to have the, the peace within us in order to really get what it is that we want physically in this life. And so I'm actually really excited about this business because it allows me to put a message out to people um, to show them what it means to just be happy, what it means to celebrate other people, what it means to, you know, show love to people that you wouldn't typically show love to. And so that's, that's really what it's all about to me is just trying to spread the message out to as many people as possible that we are put here to be happy. We're not put here to struggle. We are not put here to suffer. If there's anything that you want to do, no matter who doesn't believe in you, you can do that. And I want to be the example through my life to show people that no matter what it is you want to do, no matter how crazy it sounds, if that's what you want to do, do it. If it makes you happy, do that. Because that is where your true peace, happiness, and fulfillment really lies. Yes, definitely a, a celebration of sorts of that. Okay. And so um, one last question here about your business in, in particular. There's, there, there doesn't seem to be a lot of folks that are doing specifically what you do. Right. Yeah. But there are competitors. Have you met any of those competitors and what makes you really stand out uh, from that? So I have seen a few small businesses online doing the same thing that I do. But at the end of the day, I create my own products. You know, I am a graphic designer and I feel like that alone gives me an edge against a lot of people because I can have endless creations. I don't have to pay someone to, you know, create whatever it is I want. If I have an idea, I can open up my laptop and create it. But I mean, at the end of the day, we go in Walmart and there's 30 different kinds of bread and everybody, you, you like Wonder Bread, somebody else like Great Value Bread, you know, like we all are doing the same thing, but it's just, you know, what do you have to offer? And so for me, it's not even really about the competition. It's just that I believe in my business. I have confidence in myself. I, shame, I shamelessly promote my business. I go hard at it and I have big dreams. So I really hope to see everybody succeed. But I feel like, you know, what sets me apart for one is definitely going to be my gift shop, the items that I do offer that correlate with my wrapping paper. But at the end of the day, there's enough room for everybody to win. Yes, absolutely. And I'm, <laughs> you know, I'm getting cold. No worries. Um, I really do admire that because what it sounds like is that your passion and your desire is really wrapped up so to speak in what it is that you're doing and that's that's amazing um yeah. and, and unlike other other people in, in other spaces they they do have to depend on various different parts of this yeah. to to bring forth a passion mm -hmm. for what they're doing and like you said there are going to be many many competitors in this space but it's really just a celebration of something that that I think for myself, at least when I look at it, is something I never had as a kid and I really do appreciate it. And it's one of the reasons why I wanted to highlight 
such an exceptional business owner such as yourself. How can we find you? Want to make sure everybody knows how to make sure we can find you. I'll put it in the description of this video as well, but go ahead and tell us. All right, so you can follow me on Instagram at Melanin Wrapping Paper. Facebook is the same, Melanin Wrapping Paper. And you can visit my website online at melaninwrappingpaper.com. All right, that's melaninwrappingpaper.com. I really do appreciate you taking the time today to, to come to my channel and answer my questions and really just show the passion and desire that you have for what it is that you're doing. I think, uh, yeah, I, I, I don't even know what to say. I'm kind of speechless in some ways because it's like when I met you and what, what you do for business, I said, I, I, I just can't, I can't resist. So thank you very much for your time. Thank you. I really appreciate it.